Hi everyone, I'm Lucy from So Essential and I'm here today to share the latest simplicity patterns with you. So everything I talk about is available on our lovely website and you'll find links to our website and all the products I mentioned below. And if you like what you see today, please like and subscribe because every Friday I bring you a video packed full of sewing goodness. If you can't waste a whole week, do jump on and check out our other social accounts. We're in all the usual places and I've popped the links to those below. So in today's video I've just picked out my favourites from the Simplicity range but I will pop a link to the full range below and also we'll do a slideshow at the end of the video of the full range for you as well so do stay tuned for that. I've also linked the fabrics that I'm going to share with you, I've picked out fabrics for each pattern so just click open the description you'll find everything you need there but before we get started I thought I'd just show you what I'm wearing today as well which is one of my favourite patterns for a quick easy sew it's the Adrienne blouse by the Friday Pattern Company. I've made this top twice now. It's just got two, sorry, three pattern pieces to it. It's such a simple sew. It's for jersey fabrics. Um, this is a lovely viscose knit that we had in stock a while ago. Sadly, all sold out now, but we've got other options on the site. But yeah, it's a great pattern. There is a video um, that talks more in depth about this pattern on the channel as well, if you're interested in that. But let's get started with the new patterns. So the first one I want to share with you is Simplicity 9543, which runs in sizes 6 to 18. A 6 is a 30 and a half bust, 23 waist and 32 and a half hip. And an 18 is, I did say 18, yeah, an 18 is a 40 bust, 32 waist and 42 hip. Um, it's a really pretty dress pattern. It's got a high um, slash neck. Uh, sleeveless it's got a really wide sort of cummerbund across the waist and the top part of the bodice is gathered under the bust um, where it joins the cummerbund and then there's princess seams on the cummerbund and then a gathered sort of flared sort of a-line-ish skirt that comes out of that. I think there's two length options with this one so it looks like a sort of midi length or possibly about a knee length so there are two options there um, and then at the back it's really pretty as well it's got two thin straps it's quite low and it's finished um, zipped up and it's got princess seams down the cummerbund so basically where the back finishes is where the cummerbund is um, so it's really interesting little design Design actually I didn't realize that about the back from just looking at the pattern packet so I'm glad I had a closer look um, this can be sewn up with a wide range of woven fabrics cotton blends linen blends poplin sateen seersuckers lots of different options there um, but the purple version on the packet I thought was really pretty and it just drew me to this lovely new cotton print that we've had in recently um, which has got similar sort of hues similar purple Purples and this really pretty print on it. I think that would work really well for that dress but we've got loads of other fabrics as well. We've got a lovely um, pale blue um, cotton lawn with a white spot on it which I think would work really well. Um, we've also got this one which I'm going to show you later in the video which is a grey background with a sort of corally peachy um, poppy print on it which I love and I think that would work really well as well there's loads of cottons and things to choose from on the website so yeah have a look at those as well everything's going to be linked below all the patterns and fabrics I mentioned so you'll find them all in the description the next pattern I wanted to share with you is Simplicity 9544 which runs in sizes 6 to 14 no that's not right 6 to 24 Oh, I've picked up the smaller size here, that's why it does actually run up to a 24. So, 6 is a 30 and a half bust, 23 waist, 32 and a half hip, and a 24 is a 46 bust, 39 waist, and 48 hip. This is another one for cotton blends, linen blends, that sort of thing, um, medium weight woven fabrics, I guess. And it's got three different views on this one. It's got, um, it's like a shirt dress on the top. So it's got a little granddad collar, button down front, patch pockets um, with a pleat and a button down. Um, and then at the waist, it's drawn in by a drawstring. 
and then you've got the option for a midi length flared skirt with buttons down all the way down the front um, a shorter length skirt which is buttoned down all the way down the front or you can use the same bodice and have wide leg trousers for a jumpsuit but also you could shorten those wide leg trousers and make it into a romper or a play suit um, yeah really like this design think it's definitely oh i haven't spoken to you about the sleeves i don't think the sleeves are grown on i think so they look nice and easy no setting in there nice wide um sleeves as well gathered into a little narrow cuff at the hem so a nice loose easy breezy um pattern to wear for summer i think it's got definite safari vibes it just really screams that out to me when i look at it i think it's the styling on the packet and everything um, there's a sundress I made recently in a lovely bold mustard cotton that had a, like a black animal print on it. I think that would work really well. But also, I think that this um, linen viscose mix, which is a Lady McElroy fabric um, in the khaki and black, I think that would work brilliantly as well. Um, the, yeah, the shorter dress version or I'd shorten the jumpsuit to a play suit and make it in this fabric would be my choice. I really want to get around to making something with this fabric. It's just, you know how it is time, isn't it? We never have enough time to make all the things we want to make, but I like sharing my ideas with you because hopefully some of you guys will make some of this stuff and you know tick that box for me. The next pattern I want to share is a Mimi G and it's Simplicity 9554. It runs in sizes extra small to extra extra large and it, there's a men's and it's unisex men's and women's um, shirt pattern. So the extra small is a 30 chest, 26 waist, 32 hip and the XXL goes up to a 52 chest, 48 waist and 53 hip. So again, another one for cottons, linen blends, that sort of thing. Just a nice contemporary loose fit shirt. I really like what Mimi G's done on the versions on the pattern package. She's left a raw hem on the sleeve. Um, I think that looks really cool actually. And it looks like she's used like a linen or a linen um, blend fabric for these shirts that she's made on the front of the packet. If she made them, I'm assuming she did. She might not have done, but I do really like that sort of um, rough edge of the um, fabric at the sleeve hem. I think that's really cool. I also like the fact that she, they've used striped fabrics and then they've rotated the patch pockets on the front so that the stripes are going in a different direction to the main body of the shirt. I think that's a really nice idea as well. Um, but yeah, it's just a sort of really loose, uh, loose boxy fit shirt pattern. It's got a collar. I'm just trying to tell if it's... Um, got a collar stand I think there is a collar stand or it might be a grown on collar um, but it's like it looks like a classic shirt collar buttoned down down the front um, the description will be on the website so you can read any details on there really large patch pockets a large oversized sort of look um, with a long uh, quite a long length but obviously you could shorten that if you wanted to I think it would make quite a nice cropped shirt actually as well you might just have to size the patch pockets down a bit if you were going to do that um, but yeah just very contemporary very modern as you would expect from Mimi G and the fabric I chose I just jumped on the stripe theme with the pattern start packet styling we've got a lovely linen cotton blend that's a blue and white stripe or we've got a red colorway of this as well and I just thought that would look really nice sewn up I think I'd be tempted to make a cropped boxy shirt and make those patch pockets slightly smaller do the different directions on the patch pockets with the stripes um, and probably leave that frayed hem on the sleeves as well just take a lot of inspiration from Mimi G there um, so yeah that's my choice for that one you'll find links to all of these below by the way just open the description below and you'll find links to everything you need there the next pattern I wanted to share is Simplicity 9549. So this looks like a great sort of wardrobe staple pattern. 
um, perfect for holidays and things. There's three views. You've got it's an elasticated shirt waistband um, with an option for a little tie on the front. It's got patch pockets again, but they're like cargo pants type um, pockets. So again, very on trend. Um, that whole cargo vibe, cargo trousers has been really big this year. So in keeping with that, um, it's loose fitting trousers loose fitting shorts or a skirt and I just really like the shorts I think they're great I think they'd be really wearable and useful for taking on holiday um, this pattern runs in sizes 6 to 18 so the 6 is a 23 waist 32 and a half hip and the 18 is a 32 waist 42 hip it's another one for woven fabrics linens cottons ginghams poplins that sort of thing um, and I just thought, to be honest, I think it would look really nice sewn up. I think the shorts would look great just sewn up in some of our cotton linen mix fabric. Um, so it's 50-50 cotton and linen. This is the beautiful coral colourway, which I really like, um, but it comes in a wide range of colours. We've also got like nice prints that you could use as well, but I really like the styling on the packet as well. I really like a shirt or a blouse with shorts. I just think... I, I just think it sort of elevates the look and it's still a nice casual day look but it's just a bit more interesting than wearing like a vest top or a t-shirt with shorts I just really like that look certainly something I'm going to be taking with me on my holiday this year um just like nice blouses to wear with my shorts just to dress them up a little bit but still have that casual day vibe the next pattern I wanted to share is Simplicity 9545. So this is another top pattern. It runs in sizes 10 to 22. So a 10 is a 32 and a half bust, 25 waist, 34 and a half hip. And the 22 is a 44 bust, 37 waist and 46 hip. Um, again, for linens, cottons, wovens, medium weight, light to medium weight wovens. Um, it's a nice top with lots of different design features. There's three views. All of them have a V-neck front and then it's got a little bar sort of strap uh, that holds the V, runs across the V um, and then that seems to have some sort of elastic gathering going on from the V to the side seams. It's then got a puff sleeve which you can either have a short puff sleeve or you can have a puff sleeve and then another tier of puff to make it a full length sleeve um, or there is a sleeveless version and then it's got like um it doesn't look like quite empire line it's probably a little bit lower than that but like maybe just a bit above the natural waist but it's got like a little peplum um, that's gathered that comes out from there so quite a pretty little top lots of interesting design details to sew up and the fabric I chose for that one I just thought that the sleeveless version would look really pretty sewn up in this chambray print fabric um, it's a lovely sort of indigo coloured chambray and it's got this little white floral design on it lovely and subtle I think that would look great sewn up into that sleeveless version and then the last pattern I wanted to share with you is Simplicity 9552, which runs in sizes 6 to 24. So a 6 is a 30 and a half bust, 23 waist, 32 and a half hip. And a 24 is a 46 bust, 39 waist, 48 hip. Um, again, this one's for cotton blends, linen blends, that sort of thing. So you could make it in one of our plain linens, which I've shown you. Um, or the other thought idea I thought would be rather nice for this one is this beautiful poppy print cotton, which is a Lady McElroy design. I just absolutely love this one. Every time I do a video and feature it, I think I really, really must make something in this. I just haven't gotten round to it yet. So many fabrics and patterns and just not enough time um, but I'll just talk to you a little bit more about the design details on this one so there's two different skirts um, there is a sort of a line what looks like would be um, a sort of knee length skirt and it's got an asymmetric button down um, front so it's on the buttons run down one side of the skirt it's then got an enormous patch pocket on it which 
to be honest, I probably wouldn't bother with. I think it would look nicer without the patch pocket, but each to their own, you know, we, we've all got different tastes. So um, some people might like to make it with that, but personally, my choice would be to leave that off. Um, and then the other view is the same skirt again, but then it's just got a ruffle flounce along the hem. Um, and then there's also a little crop top with a sweetheart neckline, princess seams, um, and straps with a button down on the front um, to make to go with that. I just think the skirt would look really nice sewn up in that poppy fabric and then paired, I'd probably make the one with the flounce and pair that with just a really simple white shirt and I think it would look really pretty. Um, so yeah, so that's my choices for the Simplicity release. Don't forget, I've put links below to the full release um, and also all the individual patterns and fabrics that I've just mentioned in the video as well so do check those out. If you like what you see today, please like and subscribe and I'll look forward to seeing you next time.